Vladimir Ilyich Yulianov, better known by his pseudonym Lenin, stands as one of the most influential figures of the 20th century, whose ideas and actions reshaped the course of world history. Born on April 22, 1870, in Simbursk, Russia, Lenin emerged as the leader of the Bolshevik faction of the Russian Social Democratic Labour Party, RSDLP, and the architect of the October Revolution of 1917, which led to the establishment of the world's first socialist state. This narrative aims to explore the life, profile, and enduring legacy of Vladimir Lenin, tracing his trajectory from a young revolutionary to the founding father of Soviet Russia and the global communist movement. Early Life and Education Vladimir Lenin was born into a middle-class family of Russian nobility, where he was exposed to radical political ideas and revolutionary activism from an early age. His elder brother, Alexander Yulianov, was involved in anti-Tsarist activities and was executed for his role in a plot to assassinate Tsar Alexander III. This event deeply influenced Lenin's political development and instilled in him a sense of duty to continue the struggle for social justice and political change. Lenin's education further shaped his revolutionary beliefs and aspirations. He studied law at Kazan Imperial University, where he became involved in student protests and Marxist circles. Inspired by the writings of Karl Marx and Friedrich Engels, Lenin embraced socialism as the key to overcoming the injustices of capitalism and imperialism and dedicated himself to the cause of proletarian revolution. Role in the Russian Revolution Vladimir Lenin emerged as a leading figure in the Russian revolutionary movement during the late 19th and early 20th centuries. He played a central role in the formation of the RSDLP and the development of Marxist theory in Russia, advocating for the overthrow of the Tsarist autocracy and the establishment of a socialist society based on the principles of proletarian dictatorship and class struggle. In 1903, the RSDLP split into two factions, the Bolsheviks led by Lenin and the Mensheviks led by Julius Martov. Lenin's uncompromising commitment to revolutionary action and party discipline set the Bolsheviks apart from their moderate counterparts and laid the groundwork for their eventual seizure of power. The culmination of Lenin's revolutionary vision came in October 1917, when the Bolsheviks, under his leadership, staged a successful coup d'etat against the provisional government and seized control of the Russian state. The October Revolution marked the beginning of a new era in Russian history and paved the way for the establishment of a socialist government based on workers and peasants' councils, known as Soviets. Role as leader of Soviet Russia Following the October Revolution, Vladimir Lenin assumed the leadership of the new Soviet government and embarked on a program of radical social and economic transformation. He implemented a series of decrees aimed at consolidating Bolshevik power, nationalizing industry and land, and redistributing wealth to the working class and peasantry. Lenin's government faced numerous challenges, including internal opposition from counter-revolutionary forces, foreign intervention by allied powers, and economic hardship exacerbated by civil war and famine. In response, Lenin adopted a policy of war communism, characterized by centralized control of the economy, forced requisitioning of grain from the peasantry, and suppression of political dissent. Despite these challenges, Lenin's leadership and organizational skills enabled the Bolsheviks to emerge victorious in the Russian Civil War, 1917 to 1923, and to establish the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics, OSSR, in 1922. His vision of a socialist society based on collective ownership, planned economy, and proletarian dictatorship laid the foundations for the Soviet state and inspired revolutionary movements around the world. Legacy and Impact Vladimir Lenin's legacy as a revolutionary leader political theorist, and statesman is a subject of debate and controversy. To his supporters, he is hailed as a visionary leader who led the Russian proletariat to victory against capitalist exploitation and imperialist domination, laying the groundwork for the construction of socialism and the liberation of oppressed peoples worldwide. To his detractors, Lenin is condemned as a ruthless dictator who established a one-party state 
suppressed political dissent, and violated human rights in the name of proletarian revolution. Critics point to the authoritarian nature of Lenin's government, the suppression of independent political parties and labor unions, and the violence and repression associated with the Red Terror and the Chaika, the Bolshevik secret police. Despite these criticisms, Lenin's contributions to Marxist theory and revolutionary practice continue to shape the course of history and inspire radical movements for social change. His writings, including What is to be Done and State and Revolution, remain essential texts for students of Marxism and political theory, offering insights into the nature of capitalist society, the role of the state in class society, and the strategies for proletarian revolution. In conclusion, Vladimir Lenin's life and legacy epitomized the complexities and contradictions of the socialist project in the 20th century. As a revolutionary leader, he led the Russian proletariat to power and established the world's first socialist state, laying the groundwork for the global communist movement and inspiring generations of revolutionaries to challenge capitalist exploitation and imperialist domination. Yet, his authoritarian methods and the shortcomings of his regime raise important questions about the relationship between means and ends in the pursuit of social justice and political change. Ultimately, Lenin's legacy remains a subject of debate and interpretation, reflecting the ongoing struggle to reconcile revolutionary ideals with the realities of state power and social transformation.